Okay, here's our objective, Madison Bow Peak. We will be taking this east face dead ahead, as there's no cornices unlike the tops of the southeast face. Behind me is Brown's Peak, and back there is Libby Flats. Let's get it. All right, just equip my ice axe and micro and crampons. About to head up the slope. There it is ahead. Looks like it's no more than 45 degrees. Time is now about seven-ish, maybe. Temperature is about 32 degrees. Ready to climb. Halfway up the slope. Snow conditions are perfect. Still got a bit more to go. It's a beautiful day to be in the snowy range. We're about three quarters up the way of the face. That rock band above probably is the top. All right, just made it to the final head ball up ahead. Gonna head up and right around these scary cornices and then follow the ridge to the summit right there. The time is just after eight o'clock. And we're at the summit of Medicine Bow Peak, just over 12,000 feet in the elevation. All right. My descent from the summit up there followed the ridge, found a safe way below the cornice. And instead of taking the east face like I took for the ascent, I'm going to take the lower grade south northeast arm. Um, it's already some footprints going up. Uh, this should be a nice walk down. Just strolling down the northeast arm, head down to that hole and gonna walk on back. Just made it back down from the summit. Um, you can see loads of skiers on the east and north east faces. The time's now 8.30, it's about 40 degrees and a bit breezy. I'm ready to head home. Just made it back to the car from the summit of Mesimbo Peak. Took me three and a half hours car to car. Did a little bit under 2,000 feet elevation gain in just over four miles. It was an awesome day, ready to head home.